I, I just uh, want to express my thanks to uh, Chairperson Zuma and uh, the African Union for uh, hosting me here today and for the uh, excellent work uh, that they are doing uh, across the country. We had an excellent discussion about the common concerns that we have, both the challenges and opportunities that we see uh, with a youthful, dynamic, African continent, uh, where there's just enormous potential, and we want to make sure that we uh, realize that potential. Uh, part of that is economic, as we discussed, uh, how we strengthen trade in, inside of Africa, as well as the rest of the world. And I was pleased to talk about the AGOA uh, legislation that uh, we've now renewed for 10 years. Uh, we talked about skills development and uh, investment in human capital with a special emphasis on women and girls. Uh, we've talked about agriculture and how we can continue to build on some of the programs that uh, we are cooperating on together to help small farmers and, uh, raise their incomes. Uh, we've talked about energy, and, uh, the importance of uh, renewable energy, reaching uh, uh, rural areas through our Power Africa program, the electrification agenda that the African Union pursuing. We also noted that all of these development issues uh, depend on peace and security. And so we had a chance to discuss the good work that uh, African Union is doing in trying to resolve the conflict in South Sudan uh, and discuss uh, how we can uh, work together to avert uh, a crisis uh, deepening in Burundi. We talked about governance generally and how uh, together the African Union and the international community can encourage democratization, human rights, uh, anti-corruption efforts uh, that will enhance the well-being of ordinary Africans. So, uh, Madam Chairperson, thank you for your hospitality and your leadership. We appreciate uh, the efforts of your entire delegation. We look forward to uh, being a strong partner with you uh, for many years to come. It's a great honor to be the first U.S. President to address the afternoon. And uh, uh, I warned uh, Madam Chairperson that my speech might be a little long. Uh, uh, she indicated that uh, since they've been waiting 50 years uh, to have a U.S. President here, uh, they would give me a pass on that. <laughs> I appreciate that. Well, we we are very happy to have the, the U.S. President visiting us and his delegation, and of course, including Congress and senators. We've had a meeting with the Congress people, but now we had a very exciting meeting with the President, and I think he's given a very faithful account of what we have discussed. So what we look forward to is how we work together to implement all the things that we've discussed. And of course, we hope that we won't have to wait for another 50 years. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much.